Welcome to At Home Net's Feature Support Series. In this video, we're going to review the address book and specifically the additional fields that can be managed within each user profile. So let's go to our resident category and we're just going to randomly select a user. We are now logged in as an administrator, so if we scroll down, we can click on Edit This Person. At Home Net has provided additional fields so that you may customize some of the information that you gather from your residents. If you scroll down the user profile to the very bottom, you'll see two sections, one called Additional Information and Administrative Information. Next to each field, you will see a View Security Level and an Edit Security Level. These security levels can be customized by you as an administrator. So you'll notice on this user profile, the View Security Level is 50, which means residents can see the information and the edit security level is 50, which means the residents can customize the information as well. In the section called administrative information, the residents can see it, but they cannot edit the information in the fields below. Now you'll notice that these fields are open so that they can be edited, but that's because we're logged in as an administrator currently. So first let's take a look at how we can customize the view and edit security levels on those additional fields. If we go to our admin menu, and click on settings. We can scroll down to the first section here that's called address book profile settings. You'll notice that you see several fields called user profile additional info. You can turn all of these fields on or off by this first line here where it says show or hide. Below that you'll see two lines for each additional info field. One is for the edit security level and one is for the view security level. So as you saw in our user profile, everything in the first section was set to 50 and 50. And in our administrative section, it was set to view as 50 and edit as level 1. So just for the sake of demonstration, we're going to change our first field so that it is a level 1 edit security level and you have to save each line as you go. And the view security level will be set to 1 as well. So what this means is that only administrators can edit or see this information. So if we go back to our address book, and remember we are logged in as an administrator, and again we're going to randomly select a user in the address book, and we're going to go down to edit this person. you'll notice that now the first line here in the additional information field is a view level of 1 and edit level of 1. Also notice the information that's already propagated into these fields. If you have specific information that you want entered into these fields across the board for your entire address book, let us know here at HomeNet. Contact our support staff and we will put the information in for you into the database so that you don't have to hand enter the information into each user profile. So now what I would like to do is log in as a resident and take a look at those fields so you can see how it differs between administrator view and resident view. So I'm going to log out as an administrator and now I'm going to log in as John Brooks. So if we click on my profile, we are in John Brooks profile You'll notice that the first additional field is not visible to me as a resident now because we had set that to a view security level of 1 and an edit security level of 1. Also notice below, the information under administrative information is visible to the resident because the view security level was set to 50, but we cannot edit that information. So that's how the additional fields can be used to customize your user profiles within your address book. Thank you for joining us. We hope you join us on our YouTube channel at www.youtube.com slash at home net.